Olive hasn't seen her Nigerian husband since their wedding in February 2020. The couple expected his immigration to be approved within six months, but the government hasn't authorized it in almost a year. I miss him every day, every moment. And it's hard. Even though we talk every day and we video call every day, it's not the same. It's not the same as actually having him here beside me. And I'm praying every day we get an update, something, but we're, we haven't heard a single thing. As an essential worker, Olive has been working nonstop, but now it's her who needs some support. I'm very scared. Like, everybody has their spouses beside them, mines across the world, and what if something was to happen? The couple hired Can Do to help them navigate through the immigration process. The organization says the long wait is an ongoing issue facing all Canadians looking to reunite with loved ones abroad. The pandemic for sure has has affected the processing time, but I think the underlying issue is their visa requirement for sure. One of the key parts is that the visa office processing for countries such as Nigeria or you know more developing countries has notoriously been delayed. It just takes far and away too much time. Until those changes are made, Olive is waiting indefinitely for her husband to come home. Reuniting families is really important. There are thousands of families who are going through the same thing and their application process has been even longer than mine. Amanda Lena Letario, Castanet News, Kelowna.